Hi, it's Greg at Vanguard Motor Sales. Today I've got a real treat for you. Again, I know we got a lot of treats for you, but this thing is a 1941 Packard Street Rod. It's got a 350 in it, Camaro subframe underneath it, drives awesome, and it is one beautiful machine. If you'd like to come take a look at it, we're here in Plymouth, Michigan, which is a suburb of Detroit. You can fly into Detroit Metro Airport and call Tom at 248-974-9513. He'll send one of our guys down to the airport. We can pick you up. We'll bring you up here to our shop. We've got 30,000 square feet of indoor storage here. And right now I've got over 115 cars for sale. So come check us out. If you'd like to know the reserve price of any of our cars, go to our website at vanguardmotorsales.com. The price you see on our website is the exact reserve price on eBay. We can sell this car at any time, so give us a call. We'll take it off of eBay. We'll put it in your driveway. You don't have to get in a bidding war with somebody else who might like that car just a little bit more than you. Also, if you've got a car for sale, call Tom at 248-974-9513. We'd love to take a look at what you've got. If you know someone with a car for sale, we pay a $200 referral fee if you give us a number and we end up buying the car. Let's check out our big showroom here. All right, we're out here in the big showroom now. We've got 20,000 feet here, 10,000 feet down the street, over 115 muscle cars for sale. We have clear and free title to every one of these cars. We're not a consignment dealer. When you talk to us, you're talking to the owners. So give us a call. We'll put one of these dreams in your driveway. Let's check out this 41. All right, we're out here with this Packard now. This is absolutely gorgeous. 1941, 120 Packard into a street ride. Who would have thunk it? But I tell you what, they did it well and it looks hot. If you're catching us on YouTube and you'd like to see about 100 pictures of this car, go to our website at vanguardmotorsales.com. We're going to put it up on the left. We're going to show you everything you need to see to make a good decision on your muscle car investment or your street ride investment. We're going to take pictures of the wheel wells, under the hood, in the interior, in the trunk, everything you need to see. Also, download the seven deadliest mistakes to buying a muscle car online at ClassicCarBuyingSecrets.com. So come on up, let's take a look at this good looking street ride. So take a look at this beauty. She looks like a freight train. The nose on that thing is longer than a Peterbilt. Beautiful trim on it, beautiful paint. The paint's almost brand new on it. Good looking trim all over the car. Added all these chrome accents everywhere. Good looking door lips. Interior in this thing is hot. Body work on it is fabulous. Paint's laid down real nice. It's got um, metallic in the paint. It looks real nice. It's real, real even. You guys that know cars know to spray metallic, you got to be a pro. You got to be able to get it on there nice and even. Take a look at that giant trunk. You can get your card table, your picnic basket, your lawn chairs, everything in there. When you look down the side of this thing, you can really appreciate the bodywork. Take a look how nice that door fits. Door lip here looks good. Door jam looks good. Just an awesome street rod here. And at Vanguard Motor Sales, we're not consignment dealers, as I said earlier. We spend the time, we check these things out. I've got six full-time mechanics to check them out even further when we get them here to the shop. So if you have any technical questions about the car, like this lens missing right here, that lens fell off and broke. We got another one on order. It's gonna look just like that one over there. We have the little chrome piece that goes on top also. But take a look at that grill, absolutely beautiful. 
So if you do have any technical questions that we don't answer in the video or take a look at our ad, please call Tom at 248-974-9513. He can answer any question you have about this car. Let's check out the interior. Alright, look at the good looking door panel. The handles look good. It's got a tilt steering column in it. Good looking, uh, looks like a billet specialty's wheel. Aftermarket radio. Digital dash. Beautiful seats in this thing. Good looking carpet. Interior's definitely done up nice in this car. All right, now we're underneath the Packard. This thing is solid as a rock under here. Gas tank's in good shape. Looks like they put a new rubber hose here. Uh, the exhaust system's tucked right up in there real nice. Got some nice uh, tips here. You can see the back sides of the uh, rear quarters here. Uh, they're in awesome shape. Doesn't look like they've ever had any patchwork or anything done to them. Um, good looking 10 bolt rear end in it. Looks like we got the electric fuel pump right here. Floorboards are solid. I don't see anything wrong with the floorboards whatsoever. No evidence of any patchwork or anything. The frame is solid as a rock. It looks like a freight train underneath here. Take a look at these gigantic I-beams they've got in this thing. Floorboard again, beautiful. Nice and solid. Definitely all original to this car, never been messed with whatsoever. Running boards are steel. Backside of the rockers here are nice and solid. Looks like all of its own original metal. Got some Flowmaster mufflers, that's why the thing sounds so awesome. Again, great big old C channel here. That must be six or seven, probably six inch C channel on this frame solid as a rock. Then again, these great big I-beams X-frame here. It's got a custom cross member here. Got a, um, it's a 700R4 Trans. That's a four-speed automatic. High torque starter. And then it's got a, uh, a box frame up here. Again, custom uh, motor mounts here made off of this heavy-duty frame. Then take a look at that big old piece of tubing they made this cross member out of. All welded in there. It looks, I mean, this thing looks like it'd hold up a bridge. Uh, great big old shock absorbers, airbags up front. We've got um, disc brakes up front. We've got polished, um, looks like polished stainless lower and upper control arms. It's a Mustang II style front suspension. Another cross member up front here, solid as a rock. That's why this thing drives down the road like a dream. Let's check out the wheels and tires on this baby. Got some highly polished aluminum center lines here. Looks like, um, where's the size on these tires? Do not see the size, there they are. You got 225.50 16s. Okay, out back here, we got the same good looking uh, center line rims. Looks like uh, same size tires too, 255.50 16s. Let's lower it down and take a look at that uh, small block. All right, now we're under the hood of this thing. I tell you, this thing's ready for the show. We've got a chrome uh, power booster, master cylinder, valve covers, air cleaner, aluminum radiator, aluminum intake, aluminum water pump, aluminum pulleys. It's got a um, it's got a new style power steering pump on it. It's got HEI distributor. Of course, you saw the rack and pinion and everything underneath. Done a great job running all the wiring up here. 
Just a beautiful car under the hood. And take a look at the way these hoods work. I love this. See how it locks down here? It's part of the emblem there. Isn't that awesome? This is one beautiful street rod here, guys. You're just not going to see a 41 Packard street rod very often. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales put this dream in your driveway. Let's take this Packard for a ride. I'll tell you what, this thing will go. When you put the hammer down in this thing, she jump up and run. So we got the digital gauges here. Uh, look, doesn't look like the Speedo is working right now, but the volt gauge is working, the fuel gauge, the water temp is working. Got the aftermarket radio here. Um, it is an automatic. Steers real nice, got tilt wheel, nice padded dash here, good looking headliner. It drives real nice. It's got that uh, Camaro front subframe on it. 